Yo, 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 hey guys, it's poppin', Jacques Slade here, and as you know, school is about to start back up, and back to school kicks are definitely a thing, especially if you are a sneakerhead. Nike is having a really big sale right now, and so I went through the site and picked out 10 pairs for under $100 that could easily slide into your current sneaker rotation and save you a little bit of money in the process. All you have to do is use the code HOT20 when you check out. This is the type of video you should probably send to your parents so they know that you're really considerate about the money they're spending for school. Let's start the show. All right, really quick, before we get into the kicks, I saw this Converse camel backpack that I thought looked really dope. It's padded, it has a laptop sleeve, and the branding is minimal, which is something that I really started to look for with things that I buy. That one is only $52, and you can get one for even cheaper if you like a solid color like blue or black. Okay, let's get to the kicks, starting with basketball, and the very first pair I saw was the LeBron Soldier 11 SFG. These are usually $140, and you can get these right now for $90 in this crazy safari print colorway, and you can get those for even cheaper if you rock with a team red, mineral gold, or light bone colorway. Those are like $70, which is basically half off the retail price. All right, next up is the Kyrie 4. Depending on which colorway you want, you can grab these for as low as 68 bucks and they can go up to about $86. Considering these are already one of the best sneaker deals at $120, to get a look at all these different colorways for less than $100 is a no-brainer. The dope thing about Kyrie's is that you can actually rock them off the court just as much as on the court because they're not crazy bulky and they're really slim. All right, now one of my new favorite sort of new silhouettes from Nike is the Nike Zoom Fly. If you are a runner, you probably already know about these, but if you're not, I think you're sleeping on a dope pair of kicks just to rock, period. Right now, Nike has seven pairs that are on sale for $120, but if you use the code HOT20, that knocks them down to $96, which puts them just under the $100 price point. I have like three or four pair of these right now, and they get equal time as a performance shoe when I run, and also as a shoe just to rock when I'm chilling. Okay, let's flip this and go to the absolute cheapest shoe on the list that I would actually rock myself, and it's the Converse One Star Heritage Low. These are definitely more in the lifestyle lane, which I like, and they give that whole classic vibe. I see these like an alternate to Chuck Taylors, and if you rock them right, they can pretty much work with any outfit. You can grab those for $36, which when you think about it, is pretty crazy. And since we're talking about Converse, which Nike owns, by the way, FYI, let's keep the vibe going with the Chuck Taylor Deck Star Low. Basically, this is a pair of slip-ons that you can rock for whatever. They only have them in natural, which is like an off-white color, and with a discount code, you can grab those for 43 bucks. Randomly, uh, Jordan Brand is actually also gonna be releasing a Vans style silhouette for Westbrook. Stay tuned and I'll let you know when those officially drop. Oh, yo, quick break. So yesterday I went to the Drew League and PJ Tucker shut it down. Not only did he bring the hottest shoes to the Drew League, he switched out shoes during the games for the hottest shoes even during the game. Warmed up in the Quad 54s, played in the Oregon 13s in the first half, and then played in the Kobe 6 Barcelona for the second half of his game. Really makes me want to get those Kobe 6s again because they are Fire. Also, Harden came through in the Harden Volume 3. This is the first time that I've actually seen the shoe in person. I noticed that it has a strap. This pair actually had the blacked out boost, which was painted over, as opposed to the white, which you've seen in the leaks online. And then we also saw that it had 13 on the medial side, which is obviously his number. Don't know anything more about those. There's no official release date, no official pricing or anything like that, but stay tuned and I'll let you know as soon as I find out more. All right, getting back to the list. If you like 90s style sneakers, you can grab two styles that look pretty dope. The first is the Nike Air Force Max. These colorways are selling out pretty quickly, oddly enough, and you can grab those for $68, or you can rock with the Nike Air Force 180. These are one of the more comfy old school kicks, and you can grab those colorways for $79. Okay, so the next sneaker is already under $100 off top, but they are on sale as well and are basically a mix between the Air Jordan 1 and the Air Force 1. A basketball shoe at the start, it has slowly become a lifestyle silhouette and works across styles. This vintage coral pair is a bit bright, but you can get those for $58 and you can also get them as white as well for the same price. Now, if you skate or like the skate look, don't worry, I got you covered with two pairs I thought you should check for. The first is the SB Air Max Bruin. Nike lowered the profile a little bit to get you better board feel, but honestly, I feel like this is something you would rock after a session for a little bit of relief. Those will cost you $60 with the code. And then we have the SB Stefan Janowski Max Mid. The Janowski doesn't get the burn it used to a few years ago, but the classic design still looks dope to me. This pair has an updated collar with an Air Max unit in the heel, and you can grab those in black or this wolf gray colorway for $56. 
seven dollars all right getting back to basketball jordan brand has some kicks you can grab for less than 100 bucks and these aren't just any old jordans these are actually some of the best that they have to offer first is the air jordan 32 low i actually prefer playing in the lows versus the highs and if you happen to be a unc fan or a michigan fan you can get these for a crazy price of only 77 dollars mind you these usually cost 160 dollars for retail and they actually have a few pairs up for retail as well so i would take advantage of this deal if you can also dropping for Jordan is the Air Jordan 1 High OG. This Jordan 1 is an easy shoe to rock regardless of where you are and what you're wearing and this black and gold colorway makes things seem just a little bit fancy. The leather on this pair looks amazing as well and I bet these are going to look really insane when they start to wear in a little bit. As you guys already know, these usually cost $160 at retail but you can get this pair for almost half off at $84 if you use the code HOT20. Okay, those are the dope kicks for under $100, but I thought I would throw in a few extras if you want to get a little something extra or just get you a really good deal. First, a couple colorways of the LeBron 15 are down to $125 from the normal price of $185. The multicolor pair is even cheaper. The Nike Kobe AD is down to $108. That includes the DeMar DeRozan PE pair. RIP to the Raptors for trading him. Why? And there is also an Air Jordan 10 in what they're calling Dark Shadow. You can grab those for $137. All right, to grab any of these, make sure you hit the links down below in the description and make sure you use the code HOT20 when you check out. Yo, and just to spice things up a bit, I'm actually going to give away a pair of shoes in this video to one person in your size. The sale goes through August 11th. I'll announce the winner on August 10th. In order to win, hit the contest link below and enter your information. As always, make sure you hit that thumbs up button if you like what you see. And if you really like what you see, be sure to subscribe and turn on your notifications. I am Jacques Slade. I appreciate you and I'll see you guys soon. Peace.